In this video, I'm going to teach you how to see who is the owner of a Discord server. Sometimes you might need to contact the server's founder for an important issue, or perhaps you're just curious about who runs the show. Whatever your reason, finding the server owner on Discord is actually pretty straightforward once you know where to look. So let's dive right in and I'll walk you through the process step by step. First things first, make sure you're logged into your Discord account and have the Discord application or web client open. Next, you'll want to navigate to the specific server you're interested in. Look at the left-hand sidebar of your Discord window where all your joined servers are listed. Simply click on the server icon to enter it. Once you're inside the server, direct your attention to the top left corner of your screen. You'll see the server's name displayed there. Go ahead and click directly on that server name. This action will open a drop-down menu with various server options. From this drop-down menu, you'll need to select Server Settings. It's usually located a few options down the list. Clicking Server Settings will take you to a new screen filled with administrative options for that particular server. Now, on the left-hand side of the Server Settings page, you'll see a navigation pane. Under the User Management section, look for and click on Members. This will display a full list of everyone currently in the server. As the list of members loads, you'll be able to identify the server owner quite easily. Typically, the server owner will have a small distinct crown icon displayed right next to their username. This crown icon is the universal indicator for the server owner on Discord. Additionally, their role might explicitly state owner beneath their name or in their profile. Scroll through the member list if it's long, but usually the owner is listed near the top. And there you have it. With these simple steps, you can quickly identify the owner of any Discord server you're a part of. Whether it's for administrative reasons or just personal curiosity, knowing who's in charge can be really helpful. If you found this guide useful, please give this video a like, leave a comment below with your thoughts, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more helpful tech tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching.